Hi guys. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How are you feeling on this I'm fine, Thursday? Thanks. Hey, um, good news for you. Tomorrow you do not have a class. Oh, okay. Either, um, Excuse me? Next. You don't have a class tomorrow. There are classes tomorrow. <laughs> class no, you, you don't. You don't have a class don't. tomorrow. Right? <laughs> Why are you happy? You should be sad. <laughs> I am glad. I'm glad because it's, you know, it's a lot of work done. But hey, I'm glad to see you here, guys. How is everything? Ricardo, how is everything, Ricardo? Well, uh, today is, uh, it was hard, really, in the work. It was hard? Why? Mm, because um, I had a problem with the um, basement. You Oh, you had a problem with the basement? Yeah, because um, we are um, building a, a three house, houses. A tree house, really? Yeah. I've never seen a tree house here in El Salvador. Uh, three houses. Oh, three houses. Three houses. Three. Houses. Oh, I thought that you were talking about a tree house. Do you uh, know what no, a tree house no. is? Three. <laughs> okay, three with T H, right? Yeah. Okay, I was like, okay, I've never seen a tree house here in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, all right, very good. Hey, that's awesome. What else? Uh, well, um, I um, I have to resolve the problem with the basement, and. I'm trying. I hope uh, tomorrow I will uh, will do it. Will do okay, it. You hope to to have finished it by finished by tomorrow. Okay. Thanks. Right. That's okay. That's cool. All right, Tatiana. What about you? How was your Thursday? Hello. Hi. Hi. So how, how was your Thursday, uh, Tatiana? How was? How was your Thursday? How was today? Today is thurs Thursday, right? So how was your Thursday? Ah, um, um, my day was uh, relaxed. Okay, your day was relaxed. Remember, guys, when we use ED adjectives, it's for people, right? People, things with feelings. If you say my day was relaxed, it means, it means that the day is a person and he was relaxed. Yeah. You know, the day was like this, right? Right? It's something. The day was relaxing, right? The day was calm. All right, how do you say it, Tatiana? My day was relaxing. All right, very good, okay? All right, good job. All right, let's see who else we have here. Uh, we have here Mauricio, Luis, Jorge, Rocio, Lino, Italo. Good job, guys. Thank you for coming. Hi, teacher. All right, guys. So, hey, by the way, guys, how are how are we how are we doing with the platform so far? Are we have we completed the platform up, you know, to the point where we need it so far? I, I, I don't know, teacher. <laughs> see, is is the is the platform or or? Don't say platform. Form, I don't know if it is the platano form, right? Platform. All right. Very good. Platform, uh, yeah, but uh, I don't know if it is the, the platform or, 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 or me, right? Okay. <laughs> because on the exercise five period two, I have a lot of mistakes. Right? Oh, but we have not, guys, we have not gone to section five yet. So don't okay. worry about that. Section five, guys, is not over yet, right? We have not okay. reached that point. So don't worry, we'll get there eventually, and I hope with that. Um, so just just make sure, guys. Okay, sometimes the platform, you know, there is there are mistakes in the platform. You have to make sure that you are correct, okay? All right. Uh, and send the guys, and then we'll see what the answer is, okay? Today, guys, we're gonna talk about permission, prohibition, and obligation. What are we gonna talk about? Permission. 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 Very good. Okay. All right. Have you ever heard? Have you ever heard? Es mejor pedir perdón que permiso. Have you heard about that? Yeah. Yes. I have. Yeah. I listen. Yeah. All right. 
So that's what we're gonna be learning, guys. Okay. All right. <laughs> Very good, guys. Hey, but not not with your yeah. wife, right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> that doesn't that doesn't apply to you and your wife, right? <laughs> Only for single people. <laughs> All right, guys. So, uh, anyways, guys, so let, we're gonna talk about that. Okay. Yeah. All your horses. All right. Let me share the screen now. Okay, guys. So let's take a look at some examples. Okay. All right. Help me read. You know what? Let's wake up, guys. Okay. Whoever, whoever is not able to tell me, to give me the answer is going to be my participant. Okay. You have five seconds to answer me. So I want names of creatures that you you know what name of animals that you can eat okay five three two one let's start ricardo five four three Fish. very good tatiana five four three two one too slow tatiana all right tatiana let's go give me let me read the first help me read the first example mm -hmm. This is the first example, Tatiana. Let's go. You, you can ca camp here. Very good. You can camp here. Repeat again. You can camp here. You can, you can camp, camp, camp here. here. All right, Tatiana. Let's repeat, Tatiana. You, not you. You, guys, is Judy, okay? You. It's not you, guys. It's you. Repeat you. You. Tatiana, repeat you. You come. You. You can, you, camp can. you can camp you here. You can camp here. Camp Very here. good. Okay. All right, guys. Now, is this an obligation, guys? Or what is it? Permission. Oh. Permission. Right. Permission. 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 Very good. Okay. All right. Very good. All right. Así como le decís al esposo, hey, aquí puedes lavar la ropa, ¿verdad? All right. You're giving them permission. Right? <laughs> aquí puedes cocinar también. Aquí puedes cocinar. <laughs> you can cook here. Okay. Very good. All so right. Enough. <laughs> In your I'm, not, I'm, I'm not i'm not married so okay. all right so all right so next example guys uh let's see so yeah name of creatures that you can eat luis molina five four you can mm. eat animal two of oh. course animals okay you're cow okay very good jorge let's go five four three uh, hamburger <laughs> <Ow. laughs> All right, third, second example, or second example, right? Let's hear the second okay. example. Uh, you're allowed to take off your shoes. Repeat, guys. You're allowed to take you're off your okay. shoes. You're allowed, you're allowed, allowed to take off your shoes. Take off your shoes. Take off your take shoes. Take off your shoes. Take off your shoes. All right, very good, guys. Now, is this also permission, guys, or an obligation or prohibition? Permission. Permission. Permission, right? Permission. Permission, right? Hey, what is, what is uh, an example? What is an everyday example that you can think of? For example, guys. Let's see, uh, Leah, you're married, right? Are you married? Yes, I am. Okay, yes, so, I am. All right. Very proud. So, Leah says her husband <laughs> is allowed <laughs> to go, you know, to go partying with his friends. All right? So, Leah, is this true? I don't think so. Is he allowed to go partying with his friends? Never in the life. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> so guys, bad, so guys, bad. Guys, I'm very permissive. So I'm very permissive, but that, this nothing. This is why. This, this, this is why. This is why I don't get married. <laughs> All right, very good, guys. So I'm bye. kidding. So this is. I. I am kidding. You're not kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> so try to shrug it off your shoulders, okay? All right, we know it's true. All right, so guys, so is this permission, guys? Is this permission, obligation, or prohibition? It's a uh, permission. Permission. Yeah. permission, right? Permission. permission. Hello. Very good. Teacher. Tell me. Could you please explain why do you use uh, 
In the second example, in Berlin Pass. Which which one? You mean the third Hello. example? Hello. Well. Oh, you are because allowed. Uh-huh. Oh, this one right here? Yes. All right, it's not in the right. past, man. It's not in the past, okay? You, what is you in grammar? What, what is you in grammar, guys? Your person. Yeah. No, I say this is an object, okay? Subject. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, what is the verb that follows after that, Lino? To be. All right, Lino, thank you, Lino. <laughs> to be. In the right. second example, is verb to be. Okay, right. The verb to be, is that in the past or in the present? In the present. The present. It is in the, in the present or in the past, Lino? Thank you, Lino. Uh, allo, allo is no, no, past. no. The verb to be. What is it? What, what, what the is present, that? present. Okay. Are we talking about the present or the or the past here? The present. Okay. Very good. Now, if you use this like this, guys. If you say, for example, you are allowed subject plus verb to be. Okay. If you're talking about permission, guys, the verb has to be. This is not the past, by the way. All right, this is not allowed. It's not actually simple past. This is a past participle. Okay, got it. Okay. So use the past participle form of the verb. Okay. You can say, for example, you are, um, you are. Let's see. You are tired. You are. You are tired. Um. Uh, see, you don't say you are tiring, right? Because we're talking. We're using this as an adjective, right? So you are allowed. Two, okay. So just remember, if you're saying aloud, right, and it's preceded by the verb be, you have to use the past participle form of that verb, okay? So you're allowed to take off your shoes. You're allowed to go outside, right? Now think about this, okay? Even in Spanish, we use it in the past. Estás permitido. Tenés permitido. Permitido is the past. Got it? Got it, Lino? Yes. And, All right. teacher, and we can say you have permission for something. Yeah, you can say you have permission to go out. Yeah. But, okay. but people don't use it like that. Okay. That is very <laughs> Spanish. Right. Okay. All right. Very good. All right. So uh, th does that answer your question, Lina? Yes. Thank very you. Good. All right. Sounds good, man. All right, guys. So let's talk about the first example. Okay. So name. Of creatures that you can eat. Ana Contreras, five, four, three. Snails. Very good. Right? I thought you were going to say yummy, my, yummy. My, my husband, right? No. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. Italo Gonzalez, name of creatures that you can eat. Five, four, three, two. Um, right. Italo, let's go, Italo. Obligation. Give me the first example. Uh, you have to camp, come here. You have to camp here. Okay. Very good, guys. What is the only thing? What is the only part of the sentence that changed here, guys? Mm. Yes. The auxiliar. Use the auxiliar have to. Okay, very good, guys. You have to. This is not an auxiliary, guys, okay? In this case, yes. In this case, have to, guys, is not an auxiliary verb, okay? All right. Okay. So now, you have to come here, guys. Okay, now, we're not talking about permission anymore. What are we talking about? Obligation. Obligation. Okay. Obligation. Obligation. Very good. Okay. Elizabeth de Rivera. Okay. Since your last name is de Rivera, that means that you're married. So tell me something. What is an obligation that you would say that, that you would tell your, your husband? You have to pick up your shoes. Very good. You have to pick up your shoes. <laughs> I That's thought that you were going to say you have to pick up the kids, right? No, you have to pick up your shoes. Okay. You Very have good, to guys. wash the dishes. You have to wash the dishes, okay? Very good. Okay. <laughs> to make the bed. Yeah. You have to make the bed. Very good, okay? Oh, you have like a thousand things for your husband too, Elizabeth. All right, poor, poor, poor husband now. You guys are good. That's a good couple. All right, very good, guys. What else? Um, Elizabeth, pick someone who looks like Cheyenne. Five, four. Mauricio. Mauricio, why do everybody pick? Why does everybody pick Mauricio? All right, Mauricio, Mauricio who? Velasquez or? There are two. Uh -huh. or, or I forgot the other last one. Morales. 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 Okay, right. Morales. Morales or, or, or the other one? Morales. The other one. All right. All right, Morales, let's go. 
But Alex is not here. Yes, here. Oh, he's here? <laughs> I'm, I'm here. Okay. okay, let's go, Mauricio. Uh, so, yeah. what yes. can I do? You have to, but I, you have got to take off your shoes. You've got to. Repeat, guys, you've got to. You've got to. You've got to take off your you've shoes. Got All right, guys. Got I know, I know, I know you're going to ask me, guys, why we're using, you know, present perfect here. It's not. So this, guys, is you have got to, right? God is present. Okay. Just this is, guys, you've got means you have, okay? That's the only thing that you have to know. Don't overcomplicate your life, okay? <laughs> not your goal, guys. You've got to. So, if I say you've you got to, guys, what does it mean? Got. You have. You have to. Oh, you have. You have. It is exactly the to. same thing, guys, okay? It's just a phrase, okay? You say it like that. You have, you've got, you got to, to, right? You've got to. Is the same. You all right, so let, let, me, let me have an example, Mauricio. Um, you have to go... No, no, no. Well, you've got to. You got... Okay. Uh, you can say you gotta. You can say if you're being really, really informal, right? Uh, you gotta, you gotta clean the garden. Very good. You gotta clean the garden. Very good job. All right. Good, good, good job, Mauricio. All right. Now, uh, let's talk about prohibition. Okay. Repeat, guys. Prohibition. 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 All right. So let's see uh, Ellington. Let me read Ellington. Hello. <laughs> Tell me. Okay. Um, um, I don't know. Give me, give me a moment. Tell me. You have to read the line. Yes, sir. You can. I don't know. This line right oh. here. Just help me read. Only read and listen. Please, teacher, take off the mouse. What mouse? What are you talking about? I know. Is the mic? Sorry. <laughs> the microphone? What about no, the microphone? <laughs> what are you talking about? Mouse. The mouse. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> it, it, it was my mouse, the the point. Okay, right, very good. All right. Uh so guys, prohibition. You can't jump, you can't come here. Okay, so notice guys, what is the only okay. difference between this and this, guys? Negative. It's, negative. Negative. It's, negative. Right. it's negative, okay? So if I say you can't come here, I'm not asking you, right? I'm telling you, I'm, I'm making you, I'm making sure that you understand that you cannot do something, okay? okay. Right? I'm, pro I'm prohibiting you not to do something, okay? So, uh, so what about if I say you aren't allowed to take off your shoes? What about that, uh, Dino? This is also prohibition. Why? The only thing that we're doing, guys, is we're changing this, see, from positive to negative, right? From positive yes. to negative, okay? So permission, per prohibition, okay? Per and this per is a must. Teacher. Tell me. Per prohibition is imperative. Prohibition, um, you have to come yeah. here. Yeah, that would be an imperative. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's order. <laughs> yes, because it's an order, yes. Very good, guys, okay? I hadn't, I hadn't noticed that, but yeah, it's an imperative. All right, very good. What he means, guys, is an imperative, guys, is a command, okay? An action that you have to do yes or yes. When you say, like, go clean your house, go go clean your shoes, okay? That's that's an, that's an imperative, okay? Because it's a command. All right. So, permission, guys. What do we use it for? So, what do we use permission for? Uh-huh. Can, can, can or be allowed to. Very good job, okay? Let's see. Rocio. What do we so uh, what is the first example? You can park here. Very good. Um 
Let's see Eduardo Torres. Okay. Let's go for the next one. He's allowing to stay late. Repeat, guys. He's allowed, not allowed. He's allowed. Allowed. He's allowed. He's allowed. allowed. allowed to stay up, stay up late. late. Okay, very good. Stay up late. To stay up late. Very good. Now, let me ask you something else, guys. So, if we use this for permission, okay. Um, actually, you know what? Give me an example. Give me your own example, guys. Okay. Send me two examples in the chat room right now. So everybody send me two examples of permission right now, okay? You can either use can or you can use allow, okay? Hey, so let's go. One question, teach. Tell me, tell me. Can or allow? Allow is a past participle or, or simple past? That is past participle. Always. Mm -hmm. okay. But you can't use any verb in past participle. You can say, he is run. Okay, uh, that would be incorrect because that's not a verb for permission. We're talking okay. about verbs for verbs for permission. Okay. Okay. Teacher, for example, uh, you can take a video. You can take a video. You can take a video. Yeah, that's that's permission. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you. Let's take a look at your examples. So Horace says you can play here. She's allowed to take calls. Melvin, good job. Mauricio, you can use that. You can use that TV tonight. You're missing the the, the article there. Rocio, you can go to the party. Very good. Melvin, you can sit here. Very good. Jocelyn, you can watch TV all day. Ricardo, you can sleep here. Sleep here. Uh, Leah, you can take. Apple. An, an apple. That would be the article is incorrect. Yes. Yes. Right. Um, Anna, she's allowed to go late. You're allowed to take a rest. Okay. Uh, you can take some pictures. She's allowed to run in the park. Jorge, Melvin, good job. Carla, you can change the channel. Anna Contreras, you can wake up early. Early. Not early. <laughs> early. Uh, he can study here in the garden you can eat in the classroom you can bounce to close what is that bounce to close i have no idea what is that buy it you can buy you can buy what yes buy clothes you can buy clothes nearby okay the, the whole sentence is incorrect there uh she's allowed to come late to came late um she's allowed to come late you have to use an infinitive there Elizabeth, uh, you can play video games only today. Esther, Marta can take a nap at noon. Very good. Luis, you can. You have to pay the telephone bill. Now you have to pay um, the it's telephone permission. bill. Is that permission, guys? No. Oh, that yeah. is not permission. What is? What is? You have to. You have to pay. It's an obligation, maybe. It's an obligation, have... guys. Okay. Uh -huh. It is an obligation. All right. Uh, Blanca, you can eat. In the living room, not in living room, okay? But very good. Uh, yes, it is permission. In the living room. Okay. In, that, in the living room, all right? Uh, let's say, Luis Molina, you can park in here. No, you can park here, Luis. You can park here, okay. Yes, all right, you can park here. We are allowed to dance all night. Yeah. Okay, very good, good job. You can take a video, very good. You're allowed to play video games tonight very good you can't Luis Molina you can't park in here is correct you can't park here right you have to use the base form of the verb you okay. can't eat in in the living room Blanca you were missing the article they are allowed to swimming to swim guys guys swim. You know, yes the yes. infinitive needs okay. the base form right yes she's allowed to play with Ninten with the Nintendo he's allowed to play in at morning He's, applied, he's allowed to play in the morning, right? Um, in the proper morning. position there. You can park here. Very good. My daughter is allowed to watch TV at night. Good job, guys. And applause for you guys. Beautiful, 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 right? Good, good job. All right, guys. Any questions, guys? Or so far, so good? So far, so good? So far, so good. Yeah, All right. Okay, then. Now, before we... We jump into prohibition, guys, okay? Let's have some practice, okay? So I'm going to give you guys 10 minutes to practice. What are things that you are allowed to do in your house, okay? All right? <laughs> so couple up, guys, and let's think about 
things that you're allowed to do in your house. Now, give me complete sentences. Like, you said, use real fluency, guys. I don't want just sentences. I am allowed to eat. I am allowed to sleep. I am allowed to go to the bathroom. No, I don't want you to talk like a robot. You know what? You can say, one of the things that I'm allowed to do in the house is um, going out with my friends because my, my wife is not, you know, a bad person. So she understands. So fluency, guys, okay? Just a regular conversation. Got it? Yes, yes, yes. Very good. Yes, Let's go. All right, let's practice. Hello, Jorge. Hello, Jorge. Hello, Mauricio. Hi. Hello, Leah. Okay. Hi, Mauricio. Hi. How are you, man? Hi, and you? Very tired. <laughs> I see you. Tomorrow, but tomorrow we will in, we'll not have a class tomorrow. Yeah. Yes, yes. Tomorrow we're gonna uh, we're gonna have a good time. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um I allow um sleep late in Friday. Uh, on Friday, on all Friday, Friday, all Friday, I, 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 I'm allow allowed uh, see see Netflix at very late. <laughs> In your case, okay. Uh, my daughter, tell me. Please. Go ahead, go ahead, Jorge. Go ahead. Okay. My daughter is allowed is is uh, sleep uh, late uh, and Saturday on Saturday is uh, check the cell phone. Play with her phone. Yeah, that's... my dollar too. <laughs> <laughs> it's a problem. Yeah. In your case, Mauricio. All all the kids in this moment. <laughs> ah, very, ter very terrible, terrible. <laughs> Only in the cell phone. <laughs> all the day. <laughs> Uh, my 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 son is allowed to play with with uh, PlayStation uh, three hours a day in in vacation. Okay, sounds good. It's good. I allow to to wash the dishes <laughs> in my house because my wife is a beautiful person. <laughs> He's here with me. He's here with me. Yeah. <laughs> How do you say obvio? <laughs> okay. In my home, in my home, my my boy, um, he he are a lower um, slept too late. Uh, almost every day, almost every day, he wake up uh, night or eight or between eight or night a.m. I allow to go out with my friends to take a couple of beers on Friday night. Okay. Yo digo. <laughs> my son uh, uh, is allowed uh, to to grab late in in the in the in the Sunday.
putting my my dollar um, can listen English music in my office no allowing uh, eating in or the office I'm not allowed to eat in the office okay. all right yes um in my office I allow to I am, I am allowed I am allowed to uh, uh, go early I am weekends. allowed to go early I am allowed to go to early on to weekend no, to go repeat I am to allowed go to go I am allowed leave early leave early yes mm -hmm. what is leave early leave is you're saying go is the verb is not go the verb is leave ah okay yes what you're trying to say is leave not go uh, leave mm -hmm. early on weekends very good okay all right continue joe um um homework I'm working or in my house, home office. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> Actually, yes. <laughs> Only home uh -huh. office. I I am allowed to. I am allowed go to the work only one a week. Only that. Uh -huh. and the other days I can stay here in my house. <laughs> mm. No, no bother. No, not to bore it off in the in the house. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, because I can I can have a training all day for some uh, people. <laughs> yes. <laughs> for example, today I go to my my work. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. For example, yeah. today I went to my I work. went, sorry, I went to my work. <laughs> Boyfriend. So, That's so nice. Uh, a, you have a, it's a, and, and she has a, 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 the future is, a, okay. is there, they have a lot of opportunities yes. to work there, and, but yes. it's too expensive. The, really? Very expensive. A beer is a cost, the uh, seven at uh, 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 seven dollar one beer what what country are you talking about noruega oh really yeah thank norway. god i don't like beers <laughs> uh, no <laughs> well, norway. Norway. norway 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 how do you say Norwegian in english norway norway yes in norway, norway. it's a very expensive country so been there. yeah but you are in i mean you were in that match too so like Yes, maybe that, like things can be expensive, but you also earn that match, you know? Yes. Uh -huh. and That's then, right. So how long ago did you go to Norway? Like for how long were, were you there also? No, but it's, uh, I'm, I'm telling the Jocelyn that I have a, that my daughter studied there. Oh, your daughter, your daughter studies there. My daughter studied there in Norway. Or did she study there or she studies there? She is a study there. Okay, she okay. She studies there then. She studies there. Uh huh. She okay. studies there, and I tell her that it's uh, a, there are a lot of opportunities. A lot of uh, well, she has a, a she filled the form. A, 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 I don't know how do you say that. It's a, for herself. He do all for herself. Uh, obtain the, the scholarship. She did, she did everything. She did all herself. She, you mean. she did all for herself. Okay. And, um, How and old is he? Is she? Sorry. It's your your maybe your old like that. Uh huh. Maybe uh, how old are age. you? I am twenty one. I know it's uh, it's older. <laughs> She's older. It's older. Well, she, she has twenty four. She is twenty three. Twenty four. She she is twenty, she's twenty three, I think so. Oh, she, she's twenty three. Uh, and uh, they go there, and she's 
she's she's happy especially that she has a, a boyfriend there in in, <laughs> in alemania and that's in germany it's another it's another in life germany. it's another life you mean from Peter, germany tell me huh? how do you say irlanda ireland Ireland. Ireland. Okay. She want to go to Ireland. Do you know, David? <laughs> yeah, well, no, I didn't know that she wanted to go to Ireland. Why do you want to go to Ireland? Um, because there, there is a lot of oppor uh, job opportunities for my major. Oh, really? What are um, you majoring? Or uh, you're, you're studying, right? So I'm studying the last year of informatic system engineering. Oh, computer engineering. Computer engineering. Or computer science, yeah. just call us computer science. Hey, that's awesome. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, and I really want to go there. Nice. Really, it's hard. No, it's hard. Well, <laughs> it's, it's very hard. That. So that's uh, why I'm studying English. So you, know, <laughs> so, you know how, so you know how to program. Uh, sorry. The, so you know how to program. Yes. <laughs> Nice. What 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 languages do you special specialize in? Um, I know a little bit of Java, um, C sharp, and C -sharp. some C sharp. Yeah. Sharp. And uh -huh. other frameworks like um, React, Angular, JS, um, JavaScript, also and. Uh, HTML or oh, HTML is <laughs> not a, a language, but it's very used to create um, web pages. Yes, yes, I, I, I'm aware. Oh, wow. uh, yeah, that's that's mm -hmm. cool. All right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> and where do you, where and, and where do you study? Uh, <laughs> where do you study? Where do you study? <laughs> Tell me. Tell me. What? I study at Ayutnikaes. Uh, one time I say that and the teacher uh, thinks Unikaes oh, yeah. is not in the country. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She, yeah, she, it's just like one of these days she, she said that she, she studied at Unikae. And I was like, what country is that? Because I've never heard about Unikae <laughs> there. That, then she told me that like, that's like something from La Union or something like that, you know? <laughs> no, Nikai is, is Santana, in Santa right? Ana. Yeah, I know. Ah, in Santa Ana. Ah, okay. Yes. All right. Yeah. All right. Oh, nice. And Ilo well, Vasco, too. <laughs> well. That's good. All right. Continue, guys. That. Yeah. Uh -huh, and the sentences. I don't know. You have a question for for, for the first, uh, for example, in the, I, I can, I, I, I write my example, I can park, park here. Um, maybe in the morning and in the morning every day I, 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 I can prepare my breakfast every day. I don't know if that is correct, teacher, but I can't. Pre yeah, I. You can say I'm allowed to prepare my breakfast every day. Uh huh. If you can, if you say I can't prepare my breakfast every day, yeah, you can say that. But that's really. not that yeah that's an ability exactly uh -huh. exactly if you say i can't i can't cook my breakfast every day that would be an ability uh-huh but in this case i can use a allow to uh, as case case in this case uh-huh i can use a allow to allow to yes you can say that i am to, allowed to cook every day to cook my that, that's, uh -huh. that's actually a very good uh -huh. That's uh -huh. actually a very good highlight. Um, yeah. All right, very good, very good. good okay, okay, thank you. But <laughs> hi, teacher. Hi. What's up? Nice. It was really nice conversation with Esther. All right. What? Because Esther work. Uh, <laughs> here is my client, and we don't. What about your client? Yes, but my institution, the institution when I work mm -hmm. is the and client of Melvin. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. What, what, what is that? What institution and what client are you talking about? 
uh, I am work in in DLC. I work the gas station. I work, I work at DLC. DLC. Okay. And I am. The, and I work in Anda. Anda. Go. Mm. Anda by gas to DLC. So. From you mean from? From. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Hey, that's awesome. That's awesome. Yes. Yes. All right. Hey, you know, the world is small, right? Yes. Yeah, Blank is alone. <laughs> Blank is alone for some reason. Very good, guys. Okay, continue. You're doing a good job. Uh, enjoy your work. Yes, yes, I love my work because for um, for credit and test the software for credit. Uh, all time. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. So why is it that you love your your your, your job? Yes, yes, I love. <laughs> but why? Yes. Um. <laughs> because I say that um say Anna, uh, I love I love my work because for test uh testing a test engineer mm -hmm. for the software um, and department for credit. Oh, okay. All right. Yes. Hey, but th that's good, man. That's good. That's a, that's a good position, I guess. Right? Yes. Yes, it's, right. it's a complicated, com yes, complicated because um, I need, um, I don't know, uh, time. Okay, time. Or, yes. All right. We're gonna we're gonna go back, guys, to the main room. Good job, guys. Good job. Okay. Thank. You. Hey guys, welcome back. Yeah. Hey, uh, Hello. Welcome back, teacher. Hi, 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 guys. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine, teacher. All right, guys. Very good, guys. So we talked about uh, permission, right? And then I heard very good examples, guys. So Anna was saying that, you know, her husband, husband was allowed to go out, you know, every night that he was allowed to drink all day, right? Yes. Right. Go go out with his girlfriends. Amigas is girlfriends, guys. Right? Very good. All of that. Good wife. That's really it's a good wife. Good wife. That's, that's a good yes. wife. Good. good Anna. But but in my case, um, I am allowed uh, to do the same time. Oh, to do the same okay. things. Okay. <laughs> uh, that's all good. right. The three happy. Okay. Uh, no, the four happy. happy. Four, eh? <laughs> Feliz de los cuatro. Nice. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, guys. So now, what about prohibition, guys? So, uh, prohibition, guys. It's it's basically. Hold on. We shouldn't we be talking about obligation? Permission. No. Okay. You're right. Permission. Now, prohibition comes. No, All no. right. Now, the only thing that you're gonna do, guys, with prohibition is that you're gonna change. You know, the you're gonna change these words to negative forms, right? So you're gonna change this model, guys, to a negative model, right? He cannot smoke in the lobby. They are not allowed to transfer the phone, right? Notice here, guys, that we're t we're using not after the verb be, all right? So just take that into consideration when you're talking, guys, right? Take it to consideration that you're not talking about. I mean, take it into consideration that you're not gonna place not, guys after the word allowed okay all right so let's see guys real quick okay so anna tell me something that give me an example with with prohibition okay i was gonna ask you about your okay. husband but that's okay they are not uh, allowed to sleep in the work very good all right during work okay they're not allowed to sleep during work okay let's see um yeah. mauricio velasquez okay so tell me something that you're not allowed to do or you're not allowed uh, to do um, in your workplace. Uh, I'm not allowed to to eat in my work. Okay, very good. All right. Are you allowed to drink Coca-Cola while you teach? 
I am allowed to drink Coca-Cola, too many Coca-Cola. Eight Coca-Cola, oh seven Coca-Cola a day. Oh wow. my God, okay, oh. yeah, that's true. <laughs> poison. You are not heavy. You are allowed to oh, drink poison. Cola. Delicious poison. Delicious Synonymous <laughs> poison. <laughs> very good, okay, right. Secrets revealed, okay, very good. Rocio, all right, tell me something that you're not allowed to do in your workplace. Okay, I am not allowed to use my computer of company to... The computer uh, from my company? From my company, use to, uh, USB. Oh, okay, you're not, you're not allowed to insert or you're not allowed to... You're not yeah. allowed to plug USB drive into the no. computer, very good. All right, uh, Carla Gabriela, tell me something that you're not allowed to do in your workplace. Okay, in my workplace, is not allowed to use the cell phone. You're not allowed to use the cell phone, no. okay. Very good, okay. Tell me something that you're not allowed to do. Same same question, uh, Esther Oriana. Hey, tell me something that you're not allowed to do during <laughs> class. Esther? <laughs> Sleepy. All right, you're not allowed to sleep. Hey guys, do you I'm know not that? allowed oh, to speak Spanish, Spanish in the class? You're not allowed to speak Spanish. Very good. I have a lot of I have a lot of people. Prohibition. I have a lot of people, you know, speaking here with Google Translate, right? Who are my Google <laughs> Translate here? All right, you're not allowed to be my Google Translate, guys. Okay, that is something. I can Google Translate in my English class. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that is that is something that you're not allowed to do. Okay. Very good. I use the Google Translate. You use Google Transfer? Okay, very good. All right, guys, so uh, good job, guys. So so I think that you understood this part, but what about what about obligation, guys? What do we know about obligation? You have to take You have to or you got to. What is the meaning of you got, you got to, guys? Oh, by the way, guys, why are we using his got to? Tienes que? Tienes. Yes, but why is it his? And not, and not uh, he then. Because it's third person. Third person, guys, okay? Because this is a contraction for he has got to. Uh -huh. Okay. Got it? Uh -huh. All right, which means he has, okay? Also, guys, we're not going to say he have to, right? He has, right? Because that is, that is third person, right? He has to, whatever. All right. Got to be. Yes, all right. Give me an example, everybody. Send me an example, guys, with he's got to, all right? Either he's got to or he has to in third person, okay? Give me two examples, guys, in third person. One with he has to and the other one with he's got to, okay? Let's go. Or you can change the pronoun to it if you want or she, okay? If you want, all right? Let's go, guys. Send me an example in the chat room right now. Meanwhile, let me ask you uh, who has not participated Jocelyn, all right, Jocelyn, give me an example with got to. In third person. We got to. Um, he's got to. It's obligation, right? Yes. Uh -huh. He's got to uh, wash to wash the dishes. Very good. Okay, so he's got to wash the dishes. Good job. Jorge, give me another example, Jorge, with got to. By the way, guys, people say he gotta, right? If you're being really, really formal, he gotta. Oh, he gotta do that, right? But then again, guys, there is a lot of things that you. some people say, you know, he finna, he finna find it. <laughs> this is like really, really formal English, guys, like, like really like street English, you know? He finna find it soon, right? Or, what does uh, that mean? What does that mean? He's in a fight. This is saying he's going to find it. <laughs> wow. He finna. Uh, yeah, he finna find it. Right. All right. That, that's like really, really important formal English, guys. Okay. All right. Uh, very good, guys. So let's see. Uh, who has not participated? Melvin. Melvin. Okay. Very good. <laughs> Melvin. Let's go, Melvin. Where is Melvin? Here. Oh, um, Italo Gonzalez is Melvin. That's yeah. Okay, that's what it was about. Melvin. All right, let's go, Italo. Uh, 
Eh, repeat. <laughs> All right, give me an example where he's got to. Uh, he's got to the to the work tomorrow. No, he's got to go. Repeat, he's got to go to work tomorrow. He's got to go. To, to work tomorrow. To work tomorrow. To okay, work tomorrow. Okay. Very good. All right, Mauricio says he's got to make the, the homework today. Very good. Mauricio, uh, Melvin, he's got to study for the exam. Very good. Oh, no, there's another Melvin. You're right. Uh, Carla says he has got to finish the exam. Good job. She's have to. She's have to? All right, notice there, right? He's got to or he has to, okay? Ricardo, he has to do his homework. Good job. Uh, she can't use sugar. Okay, Blanca, we're just have to or has or, or, or got to, okay? He have to participate in class. He has. Leah, third person, right? Third person is he has. Blanca, they can't speak Spanish in class. That's not the right example. Melvin, he's got to read more books. Good job. Mm, let's see. Um, Melvin, um, Anna, he's got to work to uh, to walk more fast. No, the comparative no. is faster. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. Or fast. Just say fast. Okay. He's got to work fast. Mm -hmm. He's go. He's got to clean the room. The spelling is wrong there. Um, Tatiana, he's got to deliver, to the liver, not to delivery, to the liver. Delivery is a noun, delivery is the verb. He has got to drive the car with, with driver's license. Okay, with his driver's license. Leah, she's got to pay taxes. Good job. Ricardo, he's got to study tomorrow. Good job. Jorge, he's got to read the report in, in, the, in the work, at work. Okay, that's at work. The preposition is wrong there. Uh, Mauricio, she's got to finish the report today afternoon. Today in the afternoon, we're missing a preposition there. Blanca, you have to pay bus. You have to pay that bus ticket. We're missing the preposition there. There, I mean not the preposition. The 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 article. Uh, Eduardo, he's got to respect the work schedule. Good job. Uh, Luis, he has got to take your break. Breakfast is misspelled in the morning. Okay, he's got to buy lunch. For tomorrow, she's got to buy other another cell phone. Okay, singular, not other. Lino, she's got to buy another cell phone, not other. Leah, he's got to protect. We're missing that T there. His family, but good job with the uh, structure. Ellington, uh, she's got to return the cat tomorrow. He's got to work tomorrow. <coughs> got to arrive early tomorrow. Good job, guys. Okay, good job and applause for you guys. Beautiful, okay, very exciting, guys, very good. All right, any questions, guys, so far? Tequila or, or, or coffee, guys? Tequila. Tequila, tequila. Right, very good, okay. With coffee tequila. with milk, with lime. Coffee with milk. Oh, don't tell me that, okay, right. No, coffee with milk means that you didn't understand anything. Coffee without coffee. Okay, coffee, right, coffee with milk. milk. Okay, right, coffee, you understood like coffee with milk, okay? I feel bad about that. You need to understand like like vodka, clear as vodka, right? You see through, right? Very good, guys. So, guys, um, that concludes, guys, the section number four. four. We're going to start with section number five next week, guys, which is our last week. Oh, guys, so, uh, last next week is going to be our last week. And I'm wow. probably not – yeah, we're probably not going to see each other because – yeah, I don't know, guys. Like, I have two jobs – I'm very, very tired. <laughs> so I don't know, guys. All right, let's enjoy the, the last week together, guys. Um, so do me a favor, guys. Let's um, let's work in these examples, okay? Let's let's work with these exercises. I'm sorry. So we're gonna do 4.9 before, guys. Before Monday, okay? Before when? Monday. All right. And do the listening exercises, okay? All right. Okay. If you don't, have, if you, I right, send in the screenshots, guys. If you have not completed it, all right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell my bodyguards to kick you out of the class. Okay, le voy a decir a mis guardaespaldas que lo saquen de la clase, all right? ¿Cuál es? Right, very good, guys. Okay. All right, guys. Any question, guys? Any question? No question. All right, guys. Take care, guys. See Thank you. you.
See you on Monday, all right? Take care, guys. See you on Monday. Thank See you on Monday. 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 Bye. 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 Bye.